When I uh, when I first got sober, I, I went on a doctor supervised fast and and I uh, you know needed to chew, and then I you know we'd get handfuls of double bubble, and then I discovered bubblelicious, and so then it was bubblelicious, double bubble, and juicy fruit, and, and then I discovered hubba bubble, watermelon, and uh, hubba bubble brought me to my knees. I'm not Fred. Fred is coming. I'm Fred. I'm not Fred. I'm Fred. No, I'm not Fred, but Fred is coming. I'm coming. It all starts with Rocky up here in the center. Rocky is feeling really small and insecure. He's also unaware of the vehicles of change going on all around him. My first compulsion was uh, art. When I was very young, about eight, seven or eight years old, my mother raved about some piece of art that I did, and, and I was hooked. And it was a short time later that I got into radio, so it was always radio art, radio art. But my, um, my perspective was always uh, slightly askew to the universe. This is Rocky in the middle of the unknown. And he's gone through his program of uh, looking outward, looking for change, looking for uh, how to get through things. And he decides that he'll go within. All he finds is himself reflected in himself. All the while, the universe, which is all around him, is pulling him back out. We continue our quest, eh, Ferrato? Right, Grope. The ultimate system will be ours. To control the universe. <laughs> <laughs> There's one now! Whoa. Look, a giant galloper! It's mighty clean. Here it is, the video system from Fisher. It's all made of fish? Who would have thought? Start with a front-loading, 9-day programmable, 8-function wireless remote VHS. Yo! Savings! <laughs> add this Fisher 25-inch color monitor with built-in stereo amps at Federated Special Purchase Price. You find it all at Federated. And as time went on, I ended up in Los Angeles and, and I went to Art Center School here uh, part-time. And uh, started doing the Federated commercials and it kind of fell into my lap. I uh, came up with an idea that the company loved. And the idea was a fast-talking, basomatic pitch man. Popping in again with proof positive that Federated is perpetually plunging high prices to pathetic and pitiful places unknown. <laughs> Simple. So uh, they they said uh, that's great. If it works, uh, you got the job. And they said if it works, we give me creative control. And they said okay. So um, the first weekend business went up 500 percent. It's so hairy. Hey, thank you, babe. Oh, oh. here for me, for you. You like me to sign it? Yes. You don't sign <laughs> here. <laughs> hey, Fred Raider for Federated with a way to a great summer. Are you tired of 30 pound stereo arsenals with mega cannon whoops and tweets? Are you sick of micromanic cassette players? Do you want something more? Ooh, now the Sony D5 portable compact disc player with battery carrying case and headphones 39184. Sony compact stereo portable disc player Federated. Low prices, good prices, let those prices at good old Federated. Can I just... <laughs> <laughs> Everybody laugh. <laughs> <laughs> Look! So, so um, those commercials, I think, um, accurately reflect my... Um, my mind, my creative um, perspective. Um, I try to um, bring that out in my artwork. And the, uh, the pieces that I have here are um, part of a series called The Transdimensional Symbolism of Rocky Waters. And you'll notice in each piece there's a little um, like 30s era football player kicking a field goal. And that's Rocky Waters. And Rocky Waters is a metaphor for um, going through bad times. Before Federated, we uh, never really had much fun. And now that we have Federated, we have all this. 
So. I don't know. So, like. Yeah. I don't know. Now an RCA 25 inch diagonal color console TV, free local delivery, $499.72. Oh, yes. <laughs> <laughs> so. What? The uh, first piece is called The Gravitational Pull of Sanity. The illusion of stability gets a brain kick in the attention glands when Rocky Waters boots the world into a forced perspective contained in explosive webs and complex relationships unleashed as a hemorrhage cracks the cheerful veneer of the accepted and the expected and plunges reality into the perilous unknown. An unexpected terror unleashes heebie-jeebies, jitters, and discombobulation, never seeing the bigger picture and the inevitability of an unfathomable outcome so incomprehensibly soul-stirring and rewarding that our hero would catch a glimpse of Yahweh and enter ecstatic bliss indefinitely prolonged, only to be followed by a peaceful afterglow and quiet contemplation. Ro Rocky Waters is every man. It is the human experience. It's what we go through. It's difficult times. It's, you know, and everybody can relate to, I can't take any more. There is nothing else I can do. What do you want from me? Here, red. But does it come in pink? Pink! For 21, only 278.37. I don't know. But fun. The inexplicable perplexity of vertical pandemonium. Raw enthusiasm amplified is flinging glints hither and thither, piercing the walls of pandemonium as easily as if they were the skin of a soap bubble. Rocky Waters rides the ripplets as waves of exuberance hyperbolize, spinning down the whirlpool of infinite what? a terrifying passageway bound by choices, time, money, and liberation. Although he shivers and his hair stands on end, he fears only incapacitation by loss of his passion, his oomph, his vivacity. He plunges on. It's about human experience and, and what we go through and how we react to it emotionally. But it's also about the bigger picture. And nobody ever sees the bigger picture, you know. What do you have in store for me? You know, you know that right now nothing is working and no matter how hard you try, it doesn't get better. And you go, you have to stay in the moment. This is the revelation, this is the release, that is um, thy will be done, this is like whatever you want from me. This is the result of surrender. And he escapes from the circumstances of his, uh, of his own will and what he's attempted to find and is released into uh, possibility that is um, you know, impossible to comprehend. So, what else may I tell you? Weird TV.